Hello everybody, Game 3 here between Infi and uh, what's his name? Fairy Tail, the guy <laughs> MK Imba. <laughs> the, the, <laughs> the guy that I failed to exp counter expand on uh, two occasions. But, uh, maybe, yeah, two occasions. But anyway, Infi is going to grab an AM and like in Game 1 too. I pretty god this is a good game, otherwise I'm pretty really, really pissed off at replays.net because their users really graded one of these games with uh, highly uh, all recommended, so that's why I'm doing this. Hope I didn't steal any thunder from Compass or uh, what's his name? Uh, Blitzshotter. Blitzshotter into the <laughs> has converted to StarCraft 2, so the users are gonna be, uh, not going to be affected. Um, I'm really hoping. Trump has would do a duel with me, but he's really busy with school. He, I think he's getting masters. <laughs> Maybe I said too much. Um, and it looks like if he's gonna go do the same thing, he's gonna expand that probably here. Um, that where else he's gonna go? <laughs> One o'clock? Yeah, TNT. You're gonna have to creep. Okay, <clears throat> I, don't, I don't really don't understand the logic behind this. You waste your time to creep this camp. You're gonna get hit your level. I don't think he's gonna get level three AM out after this. Nope, he won't. So this is kind of a waste of time. He could have pulled some peasants over here and just to um, just to um, expand. It looks like he is. He's gonna do some multitasking. You know, some fun man's gonna get what? Oh, whoa! I just automatically assumed he's gonna get a demon hunter or a warden. Does it look like a beast master? Well, well, okay. A tavern build. I should have. Oh, I should have known. Should have known that alt late altar. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Oh man, I'm out of shape. Looks like Beastmaster is gonna grab a assault something here, I think, and not gonna get a boost of speed. And some <laughs> some mercs being hired. Um, looks like um, the mercs being creeped out. And looks like the Beastmaster. Let's hope the Beastmaster can turn the game around. Although I really don't think think that Beastmaster is a good hero in mid game after the priests have dispelled. <laughs> those those things are pretty much dead meat. But those quill beasts might as well just uh, bite bite um, bite the curb. <laughs> the, all the summon units in the by the curb. Beastmaster is pretty done. much another um, bear without any uh, ability. <laughs> just, <laughs> just a freaking tank in the middle. Um, after human gets dispelled, just uh, uh, never mind. I would really question the decision going Beastmaster on this game map. And it looks like Infi is going to do some uh, minor harass. Beastmaster is going to hide using Cloak of Shadows and gonna throw it on another number one Quill Beast. Huntresses are being. Um, pumped out, and then looks like Infi is going to um, throw down number mill, maybe. Um, cool, beast will fight against footman. That's funny. But uh, oh man, ah, oh, beast master is going to try to creep the mer camps and get jacked by Infi. Infi is going to take down this tree even uh, war, and he's going to go after the mercs next. Of course, they have lower HP than uh, normal units. Beast master is level three. Maybe we can see a uh, uh, level two. Uh, or mini chimp, whatever, whatever you call it. No, level two quill beast is the ability. I wonder what's the level two ability. A hawk. Level two. I was looking forward for a level two hawk, but the level two hawk is really weak. And level three AM can just pick it off with a normal attack, like four or five, four or five times, and the hawk is gonna have to turn around and run. Critical Infi is having to throw down his expansion and not of his stay in tier one. Oh my god, are we gonna see a tier 1 push with the Beastmaster? Oh man, this is gonna be good. Oh, Infi has no idea that this is going on. I don't think Infi knows about the tier 1. He also doesn't know about the Asian War being another second Asian War being built. So let's see how Infi can defend against this. Of course, defend, <laughs> defend on the footman is gonna help a lot because. Um, uh, outside of Huntress, Huntresses, they don't. Uh, Night doesn't have any other damage other, other than uh, piercing. So uh, Infi is gonna throw down the expansion finally after getting two rocking towers to defend against the Quill Beast Harass. And looks like whoa, a proxy shop, semi proxy shop, and uh, Asian Wars being thrown down. Quill Beastmaster gonna have to chuck a curry potion to get some more mana back. Maybe we're gonna see. Oh, I don't really don't think we're gonna see tier two from Job that of in this game. This is do or die here. Um, if Infi getting Infi is getting tier two himself, so he's gonna have a Mountain King, maybe a um, um, what do you call those? Uh, um, or to counter Beastmaster, really? Uh, Mountain King would be more than enough. 
A M's confused after seeing all this huntresses. I would have personally be confused too. A AM is gonna have to, have to scout around to, for some cross Asian wars. <laughs> I would be confused as hell. Power rush. Oh, how can I forget? How can I forget Huntress Tower Rush and Beastmaster, of course. You got a level 3 Beastmaster. And Inji's gonna power up himself back in his main and uh, let's, let's see how he's gonna defend against Tower Rush. Maybe Inji's gonna do a base trade. That's a way to go to um, counter the left tier 1 push. There's nothing, absolutely nothing, not even Asian War back in that off base. So he, he's a. So the Nana is completely open to freaking base trade here. So Moose has been pulled and just buy some time against the towers. And uh, here we go. Nana is going to retreat, leaving those towers constructing. And here it comes. Yinfi is going to go straight to the main. I think Nana is going to have to TP because he can't just <laughs> can't afford to lose that main, dude. Um, here the tower is going to be finished. Um, <laughs> it's kind of cheese, not of cheese, but the cheese nonetheless. Uh, effective cheese. There's a TP, and Nifi's gonna probably counter TP or he's gonna walk out of there. Um, it's like one of them gets to abolish magic by the works. And these towers are now open to whatever Nifi's gonna try to do. And, um, I, would, I wouldn't call this failed tower rush yet. Um, he's might actually use the stop job to come back, maybe get another crow beast. Just to get the keep the uh, keep those towers in low HP, and uh, th that Asian war critically gets taken down. So we're, we're gonna see the slower production out of, out of Night Elf. I wonder what Night Elf is gonna try to do um, here with uh, additional gold because oh, it's gonna be high more mercs. Yifi has more mercs as well because Yifi has better <laughs> economy. Maybe we're gonna see uh, probably Shredder out of this go go Goblin Lab because it isn't. Shredder has cooled down already. You know, you know what I'm talking about. The shredder is able to hire, is, is able to being hired or whatever. And maybe a dropship would be uh, dropship. Uh, Goblin Zeppelin would be fine. Um, he's gonna TP out of there. I mean, after these tower, all these three <laughs> freaking uh, militia men being killed, counted like three filming corpse and about a seven, eight uh, militia corpse. If he, if I were if he ought to get the tier two out of this town hall. Maybe he's gonna try to stay at tier one. There's a mini mini chim I was talking about. Um, that thing, <laughs> that thing is gonna he's gonna get taken down quickly, though. rather quickly. And Footman's gonna have to play keep away from that mini chim. Let's see, the towers are all in position to see up the uh, human expansion. Of course, the, the heavy armored. He, he, tier 1 human units aren't gonna do anything versus the melt versus the mini chin, especially the one armed those. <laughs> and uh, if he's, let's see if Yifi uh, get a, a what do you call it, tome of retraining, get some uh, blizzard on those towers. I don't think, I don't think any, uh, none of has anything to stop the blizzard. I don't think he has a, uh, no, he doesn't have entangle. Um, continue to stay with the tier 1 push. Uh, that many hot mini trims may have taken down with a tower with uh, and uh, take down a two down a tower with it. Looks like the uh, wood, uh, the mod golem is gonna get killed by the footmen, but the uh, footmen trading on mod golems, mod golems are always good trade. More militia are being brought up. If he has three, uh, four, maybe four militia on gold right now on the main, but he's out of the economy. The, oh, a <laughs> sapper! <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be fun. Oh, the sapper didn't get it. Ah, oh. <laughs> I didn't get there. <laughs> That's funny. If you try to sneak in the sapper and take down the towers, yeah, Sky, Sky. Um, I'm talking about a, another human player. Sky would have uh, gotten a uh, Katoma retraining. And what is he doing? Um, where is that beastmaster going? Okay, where did he go? Looks like uh, oh, where where are the whips is going? The whips are going straight back to put down more towers. Oh man, this is, this is insane. <laughs> Nothing that elf. Um, I would personally would have uh, gotten uh, go to the shop. Well, the shop is under the crept. So I'll go to the shop, pick up a phone retraining, and get a level 2 blizzard and level 2 a uh, uh, level 2 uh, what do you call that? Brain Zora just to show on the to throw that throw that level two blizzard on the Asian protector. And more Asian protector ready for it now. Looks like Infi is going to uh, mass repair. Yeah, Infi is skipping out making peasants out of his main for some reason. Uh, but uh, I mean he's not. <laughs> he's just not uh, get around to select his main. Now he's going to make a peasant. 
No, out of both, I hope for an hour of both towns. Um, anyway, let's have more towers being planted uh, by both players. Let's see who's gonna get a better best of it. Level 3, oh, level 3 Hawk. Oh my god, this is gonna melt whatever his humans has. It has the arsenal. And I will Hawk's gonna focus down, taking down here by all the wall until. Abolish 